Just up the road in Huntington, a local watershed group is working with two area grade schools to teach students about aquaculture, ecology, and environmental stewardship by bringing catfish to the classroom. The DEP's Mike Huff explains. Some visitors from Cincinnati got to meet their new roommates for the next few months. Students at Southside Elementary and Meadows Elementary in Huntington will feed and care for two dozen channel catfish brought in from a fish farm in Ohio. The fish are part of the Four Pole Creek Watershed Association's Catfish in the Classroom program. Four Pole Creek is just a few blocks from both schools. Kids are going to learn a little bit about channel catfish. They're going to raise those fish and see how they grow throughout the, throughout the spring. Um, they're going to kind of take some ownership of the creek and hopefully they'll be more willing to uh, protect that creek and, and, um, and view it as a valuable resource when they get older. Um, they're also going to use um, a scale to, to measure the fish um, and weigh the fish uh, and so they'll, they'll uh, be able to use graphs to, um, to track that growth throughout the couple of months. We worked with the West Virginia DEP and the West Virginia DNR to get permissions to raise the catfish um, here in the, in the school and to uh, uh, raise them for two and a half months and then put them back into Four Pole Creek. The program is funded through the Stream Partners Program. The Ashland, Kentucky PetSmart helped out with two 60-gallon aquariums and related equipment. Organizers hope the program sparks a lifetime of environmental stewardship. Introducing the materials easy, um, uh, maintaining that interest is important because uh, the, the, the values that they have now, that we instill now about the, the need for protection of water and water quality and drinking water and, and those animals that live in the stream is going to go a long way when they're adults to, to helping us continue to protect that resource. And it's a message that seems to be resonating with these fourth graders. I think that the catfish are a really good way for our school to help the environment. How is that? I think because we're releasing get more fish into the environment, so it'll help the environment with the natural habitat. Uh, I think the fish are really cute and they're uh, really cool. I think that it's nice to have fish here because there's not a lot of schools that um, really have it, so it's nice to be sort of different. Uh, this project is kind of a precursor to our water conservation fair that we do here each year and um, so we're teaching the children how that the watersheds are related and how the things that happen in Four Pole Creek end up in the Ohio River and about water pollution and the importance of water conservation and so we just thought this would be a really neat way for them to kind of take part in something that actually ends up in the creek and could eventually end up in the Ohio River in a good way. <laughs> the fish will be cared for by students from the second and fourth grades. The project will also be featured at the school's upcoming annual water conservation fair later in the spring. In Huntington, I'm Mike Huff for Environment Matters. The Stream Partners program is a cooperative effort of the West Virginia Conservation Agency, the DEP, the Division of Forestry, and the Division of Natural Resources. The program is housed within the DEP's Division of Water and Waste Management.